So today I will show you a cool new feature of the ExoCloud IDE. You can now deploy your application to different uh, Cloud Foundry targets. So that means that if you're using the Cloud Foundry Micro Cloud, or if you want to deploy to another pass that's based on the Cloud Foundry open source project, you can actually do that from the IDE. So uh, let's get started and show you how you can do that. So we'll start by creating a new Spring sample project, and I'm going to call that Spring App 1. So that generates a sample shopping cart project. So in the past menu, I'll create a new application. And you see here that we have the default Cloud Foundry server with the API endpoint. So I'll start by deploying an app to the Cloud Foundry public server. So I put in my login. And password. So this application already exists. I'll change the name and we should be good to go. So now the application is actually building. So this can take a few minutes, so I'll fast forward a little bit. And once it's built, the application is deployed on the Cloud Foundry server. So as you can see, Spring App 1B is successfully created. So we can now start the application and access it right away. So that's our shopping cart project. All right, so now let's try to create a new application and deploy it to another um, Cloud Foundry target. So I'll call this one Spring App 2. Create Foundry application again. This time I'll change the API endpoint uh, to the um, AppFog server. So AppFog is another pass based on the uh, Cloud Foundry. So it uses the same APIs. So it asked me for my credentials again. This app already exists too, so app 2B. Initializes the Git repository, builds the application, and deploys it. So that's it, the app was created, and again, we can start it. and start using it right away. And so, as usual, you can monitor your applications from the IDE. So in the Cloud Foundry menu, you have an application menu, and here you have all the applications deployed, and you can change uh, the server that um, you want to monitor. So you see my application deployed in Cloud Foundry and AppFog. That's all for today. Thanks for watching.